pray with faith. Amen. I, I, I just believe God has, uh, we were able to communicate with one another that uh, God will give us the, the, the wisdom to be able to go through this section without any interruption in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Please, I want to hear your response. So if, if, if you are not hearing me, let me know. Okay, let me know if you are if you are not hearing me loud and clear, please just type so we I know what to do. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Pastor um, Pastor Ben for Pastor Paul from Germany, I can hear your voice loud and clear. If all of if all of, if all of us can can respond the way Pastor Paul is responding, I will see the devil will be in trouble tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Yes, uh, we, we bless the name of the Lord for how the Lord has been helping us by His special grace and by His special power on all our online prayer meetings. We are going to spend some time to pray and then as God gives us opportunity, we are going to see some revelation in the scripture how to have victory over every stubborn uh, uh, sacrifices of the wicked. Let's open our mouth. Let's bless the Lord. Let's thank God for the opportunity we have. I want you to open your mouth to show him appreciation. Just praise him. Give him the glory. Give him the honor. Thank him for his grace. Thank him for his power. Thank him for his protection. Thank him because he is the king of kings, the lord of lords. We worship the Lord and give him the glory due yes. unto his name. There is no one like unto our God. Thank Him for this month you are, the month of May. Thank Him for preserving your life. Give Him the glory. Give Him the honor. Give Him the Thank you, Lord, for your mercy. For your goodness, your compassion, your mercy towards me and my family. Thank you, Lord, for your goodness. Thank you, Lord, for your presence. Thank you, Lord, for provision and protection. Thank you, Lord, for the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the protection by the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, that Jesus will you. Thank you, Lord, by the blood of Jesus. We have victory over the, all the enemies. Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your presence. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness, your goodness. Lord, thank you. We praise you. Bless you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for even the opportunity to get together with the brothers and sisters to be able to pray. We are your people, your people. We are your people. Thank you, Lord, for redeeming us. Thank you, Lord, for redemption through the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, that you came to take away our sins. You came to destroy the works of the devil in our lives. You came to destroy the works of the devil in our lives. Thank you, Lord. You are worthy. You are worthy. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Because we are victorious. We are more than conquerors. We are all conquerors because we are in Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for healing, deliverance, for freedom, for victory. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Online prayer conference. I want to tell you, you don't know what God is doing in our midst. 
there are a lot of arrow the enemy is shouting against you against your family but through this online prayer meeting on thursday on saturday on monday on sunday through this online prayer meeting god has been keeping you victory and god has been preserving your life and you don't know how god has been you on ego wish of the prayer meeting and a prayer point was given and you prayed that prayer that week an arrow was shot and that arrow was diverted and that arrow misfire ha God has been working in your life. You are going to thank God for his deliverance in this online prayer meeting, for his power in this online prayer meeting, for his manifestation of his protection that he shed your life and protect you in this prayer conference. Worship the Lord and bless his holy name for great deliverance. He has been delivering you every time we call for prayer on this online. The Lord has been so mighty in our life. Open your mouth to our position. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your for protection. Thank you for your faithfulness in our lives. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for protecting us from the arrows in our lives. The enemy, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank that he may redeem us from all iniquity. I don't know the iniquity that is present in your life. I don't know the iniquity that is present in your thought. I don't know the iniquity that is rampant with your life. Folks, thanks be unto God. Okay, the Lord Jesus Christ, he gave the self for us that he may redeem us. You are going to pray tonight. Oh God, let the blood of Jesus redeem me from all iniquity. Oh God, let the efficacy of the sacrifice of the death of Jesus put away every spot, every sin, every unrighteousness, every unfaithfulness, every uncleanness away from my heart, away from my soul. Push me, I shall be poured. Why can't you present yourself before the Lord without want any entrances? We don't want Satan to say, Jesus, I know poor, I know who are you. We don't want we don't want Satan to say, demons will say, Jesus, I know, poor, I know, but who are you? God, bring your life under the mark of the blood. Say, God, I break my soul under the mark of the blood of Jesus. Yes, I present my, my life under the mark and the efficacy of the blood. The and the washing of the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for the protection we have. The blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank but all we claim the merit of the blood of Jesus over our lives, over this prayer. I will claim the merit of the blood of Jesus over this prayer platform, over the internet. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. There's power in the blood of Jesus. There's victory in the blood of Jesus. Yes, we have breakthroughs, healing, deliverance in the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the blood of Jesus. Yes, thank you for the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the sacrifice of our Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you,
speak for us in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Our Father, we thank you for the sacrifice that Jesus Christ has paid. Yes. It's a great sacrifice. The Bible says, who gave himself for us, that he may redeem us Amen. from all iniquity, yes. from all affliction, yes. from all sicknesses, yes. from all oppression, from all bad love, and from all disease. Yes. Hey, through the death of Jesus, we have victory. Through the yes, death of Lord. Jesus, we have dominion. Yes, Through the death yes, of Lord. Jesus, we have power. And yes. tonight, yes, as we call upon to overthrow every wickedness of the enemy out of our family and our life and our ministry, we pray victory will be called for us in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 We we, we pray that you will take absolute control. Thank Amen. you, Father. In Jesus' you, name, we pray. Amen. Amen. And welcome, everyone of you, once again for tonight's online prayer meeting conference. Tonight, by the grace of God, I want to look at this topic as we pray together. Uh, for about uh, three months now, Beside me, I have been talking on deliverance every Thursday night. Deliverance every time. And there is a reason why I am doing that. Because prayer time is a time of warfare. Prayer time is a time of fight. Prayer time is a time that you need to, is a time that you need to break through and to have freedom in your life. We have we have different kinds of prayers. But if you are special and pray for this area, this section I want to talk about tonight, you will discover you the battle with us be there, and you will not understand. But if you have understanding tonight, you will overcome. And I don't Man. want you to be ignorant. The Bible says, "My people are destroyed because of lack of because of not the lack of the word of God is destroyed." But tonight, I'm going to show you something from the Scripture that you open your spiritual eyes to let you to know. Now, what we are doing is 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 is, is spiritual and is biblical. I would take my, the topic of tonight prayer is deliverance from dangerous sacrifice and all wickedness. Deliverance from dangerous sacrifice. Dangerous, not ordinary sacrifice. So I call it dangerous sacrifice. I will show you some of the sacrifices. Some of the sacrifices in the Bible. They are dangerous sacrifice that the kingdom of darkness. Dangerous sacrifice that the king of Moabite. Dangerous sacrifice that the king of, 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 of other nations make through their sacrifice that defeat Israel. Some dangerous sacrifice. And if you don't, if you don't understand it, your those is over that. Your heaven will be blocked. You are praying, praying, praying. You don't know that somebody has made some dangerous sacrifice, and that sacrifice is speaking, is working against you, against everything you are doing. But for tonight, as I show you from the scripture, that so sacrifice, how to defeat, how to disband, how to destroy the sacrifice, you will have victory tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Please, I want to say this: if you are coming on Thursday, please come with your Bible. Always we want to see your Bible. What the Bible, so that's what we are reading, not just acknowledge is scriptural. I, I took my test with the book of Second King, chapter 3. Open your Bible if you are with your Bible. If you have a Bible, you can listen to me. Second King, chapter 3, from verse 1 to verse 21 to 24, and 26 and 27. Second King, chapter 3, from verse 21. Here the Moabites. They have a contention, a war against the children of Israel. And then the Moabites, they overcome the Israel, they defeat the Moabites. When the Israel defeat the Moabites, and then the Moabites was afraid, their king now went back to go and strategize, and he made some sacrifice. And that sacrifice made now keep the Moabites victory over the children of 
of Israel because of the demonic and evil sacrifice he made. I took my text from 2 Kings chapter 3 from verse 21. 2 Kings chapter 3 from verse 21. And when all the Moabite heard that the king was come up to fight against them, and they gathered all that were able to put on armor and upward and stood in their border. Verse 22. And they rose up early in the morning and the Saw shore upon the water, and the Moabite saw the water on the on the other side as red as blood. Twenty three, and they said, "This is blood. The king has surely slain, and they are smitten one another. And now they are for Moab to the to, to the spoil." Verse twenty four, and when they to the camp of Israel, the Israelites rose up as more the Moabites. The Israel rose up, they defeat the Moabite. The Israelites rose up, they overthrow the Moabite. The Israelites rose up and then they, 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 they smote the Moabite so that they fled before Israel. But they went forward, spitting the Moabite even in their country. Verse 26. Look at verse 26. Verse 26. And when the king of Moab saw that the battle was too sore for him, too strong for him. When the king of Moab saw that the battle against Israel was too much, because Israel had defeated, it was too much for him, he took with him 700 men that swore, swore to break through even unto the king to end all, but they could not. See what he did in verse 27. See what he did in verse 27. Then he took his elder son that had prayed in his stead and offered him for a bond offering of all the world. And there was a great indignation against Israel. And there was a great indignation against Israel. And there was a great indignation against Israel. And the depart from him and return to their own land. Hear what happened? The Israelites have a battle with these people of this of this Moabite. And Israel overcome, Israel defeat the Moabites. And then the, 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 the king now saw that Israel has been, the battle was too much for him. He made another plot, another strategy again. He couldn't again defeat Israel. Look what he did this, this king. He took his head up, his his own soul that's supposed to be next of king is matter if he offer it as a pot of free sacrifice when he do that sacrifice this but he didn't feel what happened there was a great indignation against israel and that is why i titled it deliverance from dangerous sacrifice and wickedness deliverance from dangerous sacrifice it was an evil king who knew not god this was a king that is full of them, uh, that, that, that they are eating, that, that they are idol, worshiper, what they can do, and they offer source sacrifice. And the Lord, and what happened? The power of their gods, because they worship a foreign god. They, they, as, they, as he sacrificed that his elder son for their gods, a lot of things began to take place. And Israel were not able to start, and there was a great. My dear brother, I don't know what sacrifice, dangerous sacrifice they have made over your life. That since the evil people, the Moab, the Moabite, did those sacrifices against you, against your business, against your marriage, against your ministry, against your war, against your health, things have been falling apart. Things are not working the way you're supposed to work. I don't know what they have been, the sacrifice they have made and they have been. And see the better sacrifice. Anytime you pass that area, you will have a sharp pain in your day. I don't know the sacrifice they made, but I want to tell you that there is deliverance tonight. There is quite deliverance from dangerous sacrifice and wickedness. Just yes, just um, on um, Tuesday, yes, on Tuesday during the ministers' conference, uh, somebody, somebody, somebody called me. It may be online now. It may be online. He said, uh, 
told me that um, his only have a, a brother they are playing football and then because they are playing football, so he was good in playing the football and then uh, one they are in a, they, they were in in, in Kanuna in Kaduna and then so I went me to pick them to travel out to take them to Europe. And when he called me, he told me, I said, What happened? He said, since he arrived in that team, when he was he used he used to he's a winger, anytime he played, he used to score. I used to assist to assist to score goal. Now the guy that was playing over eleven, they dropped that guy. Well, they dropped it. They now picked this 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 other uh young man, not born again, not a Christian, not I did not know him, but someone just connects, connect me, connect him to me. So we spoke. In that said, since they dropped that guy, anytime he entered the football field to play, it's like a need to soak in his leg. He cannot wear the boots. So play like a need to go, and the post they will now substitute him. They will now bring him out again. The they took him to the hospital. They do s They say nothing is happening with you. You are okay. He went back to the football field. The moment he entered the pitch, playing football like this, it will be like a needle was shooting the boy's leg. The guy shooking his leg. And the coach has to drop in. The coach says he has to go back to Lagos, to, 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 to their state, a quiet one. That if his feet back, it will come for the match and continue. And the guy called me and said, please, he said, this is a weak idea, I understand. That's what I'm saying. No, sir. The person that being responsible for that sacrifice, that demonic sacrifice, that, that boy, that brother need deliverance. And there are people who did a carry dangerous sacrifice out against you yourself. You don't know. You discover things are not working in your life. You discover there's embargo, the devil place in your life. You discover that anything you want to move for, there's a resistance. Every sacrifice any Moabite have carried out, every evil sacrifice that they, they, they have done against you, the Lord God Almighty will throw them down, and you tonight we have complete deliverance in Jesus' name. Amen. Many years ago, as I was praying for a, a, a particular lady, the true story now, a voice from her said, Excuse me, sir. What is your trouble? What is your problem? I said, I do not have any problem. Ina said, What is your problem? Is this lady your, your daughter? Is she your wife? Is she your aunt? The boys keep on asking for that. And I said, Then I said, I will leave her alone. And let me finish her. He continues saying that, But you cannot finish me. Because she has, because not that I say because I thought I thought that because this lady, the voice it was a lady, but it was with the voice of a man. A lady. I told I told her I said this girl is born again. She's a child of God. She belongs to you. He laughed. He said, "You think he's born again?" He said this one is not born again, no. He said, "If you want this lady to follow your Jesus, I will let him. But he will continue doing the fornication, fornication that he's doing." I will come back again to meet her. It was a voice of a man speaking through that lady. She walked, the spirit man said, he gave him band. He said that I still have my home. She walked into my territory when she said so. And I called Isaiah, I said, and I called Isaiah, and they are the they take it for the might. Or the local can't be delivered. He made I give her that scripture. They kept quiet. Even though she walked captive lawfully, I said, but thus says the Lord, even the captive of the mighty shall be taken away, and the day of the terrible shall be delivered. I give her that scripture. The man speaking through her quiet. Deliverance. And for the times when they are there are some, there are some, there are some deliverance, there are some, there are some things that occur in your life, in your family, in your in your ministry, around you. You don't know. Moabite, the king of Moab, and the king of and the king of um, and, and uh, Egyptians, and all those wicked people, you don't know the evil sacrifice they carry out. And that is why you have those defeat over there, you have challenges in your marital life, you have challenges in your place of hope, you discover people just hate you from nowhere, they just hate you, they just hate you, they don't want to come here again. Yeah, yeah. Every spear they have put upon your life, every sacrifice they are carrying out over your life. Tonight, you are going to break through from those people sacrificed in Jesus' name. And I say the Lord God Almighty will 
to manifest his power in your life tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And that is why, that is why, that is why you must lose yourself to pray. And these people, you don't let me let me once again. Some of them fasted for seven days. This Moabai, this wicked people, they fasted for seven days. And some of them fasted for 40 days. And then you'll be surprised. You'll be surprised that when they are breaking their fasting, they break it with alligator per day. They wait, they are fasting, no demonic fasting, and they break with alligator per day. And they begin to speak dangerous well. Cause destruction of one life of people with their evil powers. Satan has to repent. Of all the people used to fast, witches and wizards, they don't go fast. If you don't let me tell you, all believers fast. People in other religions fast. And people that are looking for spiritual power, demonic, they fast. And some of them break their fast with, with all this um, and they get up there to cause havoc of all their life and people's death. I pray for somebody tonight. Whatever rubbish they are from is your death. Then Lord God Almighty will draw them down. You will be delivered from such evil sacrifices working against your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want you to go before the Lord tonight. Right now, there is no time now. Just present yourself before the Lord and tell the Lord God, I want to thank you because there is deliverance in my life tonight. Call upon the Lord, just pray and say, God, emote yourself. I want to hear you praying. I want to hear the voice of people praying. I want to hear your voice praying so that I can be giving you some guidance. in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Uh, you are you 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 people. You are praying like like people who are not who, who do not even know what they are doing. You people, you are praying like people that <laughs> people that change different prayers and say, "Well, I'm okay. I'm not a witch. I'm not a wizard. I'm not a familiar spirit. <laughs> I don't have I don't have this and that." My dear brother. Israel of God are they not born again? Why do the Moabites destroy? There's a great indignation when they are this when they are this day is ever so to God to give them victory. Why there's great indignation over them? Why don't take this thing? You see, sometimes though, sometimes some of us in different life, when we talk about the difference, we are so we are so. We, 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 we are so, so mild. Say, what is he talking about? Eh? What is he talking about? My brother, my sister, you better pray so that you will not pray. You better pray. You better stop their evil activity so they will not stop you from making progress spiritually. They will not stop you from making progress spectacularly. You are going to pray. Every evil sacrifice any man or woman that carry out in my life. Oh God, by the blood of Jesus, I throw that down. Oh God, by the blood of Jesus, I destroy it. Whatever sacrifice any man or woman of tissue products affecting your life, ask the Lord for those sacrifices and destroy the source of those sacrifices. Oh, your mouth and pray. Father, we pray that any sacrifice any sacrifice for my sake. This sacrifice is not for my wisdom. But the spirit of 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 the spirit
Só que é mais para isso. Ah, deve ser que é mais. Não tem nada. Ele está bem, não acho isso. 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 Ele está bem,
Father, Onua, Onua, glorify yourself, glorify yourself, glorify yourself, glorify yourself. In the name of you, I be manifested. You be manifested. Father, be manifested. In the name of Jesus, Onua, Onua, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. We have the victory. We have the victory. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We have the victory. it is time for you to arrive. Father, hold on and destroy and put down. Father, every rated sacrifice, that every rated altar that is fighting against my generation, fighting against your will, against your righteousness, against your glory, against your, your blessing. In the name of Jesus. Oh, that the wicked one has raised up. That is what he gave me so on the day my father. Destroy them this night, O Lord, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Is your soul definitely I was living for that for the time not yet. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen.
I know the network is bad. Yeah, let's continue to call upon the name of the Lord. The Almighty Father take total control. Call upon the name of the Lord. The I, Ali, with my wife, with my husband, with my children, I will not come empty handed. Call upon the name of the Lord. My miraculous way. Let me, O oh Lord. Let me see you at the point of my need, at the point of my husband's need, at the point of my wife's need, at the point of my friend's need. Tell Almighty God that, Lord, you know what? People are looking at me. And they are seeing that every time I'm in your house, I'm on my name. I'm looking unto you. Call upon the name of the Lord. Father, surprise me, O oh Lord. Surprise me. Surprise my husband. Surprise my family. Okay, sure. Call upon the name of the Lord. That by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ. God will comfort you. God will comfort you. Jesus. God will wipe away my tears in Jesus' name. God will wipe away your tears in Jesus' name. I'm that anything that is giving you concern that you are bothering about, if you tell other people, they will say you are not born again. Hmm. If you just tell your pastor, they will say you are backsliding. Hmm. If you tell your friend, they will say, look at yourself. And you call yourself a Christian. And then you tell unbeliever, they will see then what is your purpose of serving God? You are not in the midst. You are not in the middle. But I want to tell you, God sees everything. Call upon the name of the Lord. The Almighty Father, I come before you today. The second of May. Jesus, is significant. Something that I've never thought is possible. Something I've never thought you can do. Call yeah. upon oh, Visit me, O oh Lord. Been this journey for so long. Yes. I've walked this journey for so long. I've tried in this journey for so long. The same situation come on to Peter, and Peter was asked with other disciples. Not to Jesus. 5,000 people, they were gathering. When the Jesus had delivered the, 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 the message, every one of them, they left. Peter was asked, what about of God? Jesus so promising the kingdom of God. Call upon the name of the Lord. The power and the blood of Jesus Christ, by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, in this journey, you will never be ashamed. Yes, there will be a circumstance. What I saw D.S. in the Philippines today, I saw him. Something came to my mind that do you know what? When he was passing through a lot, who are there? But that this one is moving from Abba, he moved to another country. He's moving to United Arab Emirates in the next meeting. Then when the challenges were there, when he was arrested by police, when he was called to the police station, when he was sending his car, nobody was there. Call upon the name of the Lord. Yes, you are passing through. The money will be your portion in the name of Jesus. Huh? My dear mom, my dear dad, wipe away your tears. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the enemy can shake. So I'm not saying. Whatsoever they might have done in order 
to stop all our progress in order to beat my source Jesus. in order to put us in chaos in order to stop our testimony the time of my sister my mom my dad brother my colleague Things in the body. God knows about everything. And I said, let me know. There's no way, no air out of the, all the air in your body will fall that God does not know about it. If it is, He knows about you. Do not pay. Do not stop calling upon you. Do not be discouraged. What is that particular thing? You think it's very impossible. You think that it there is an hindrance. You think that it can never be done. And we are even thinking if it is going to be done, it will be too late. Father, I pray. No fine, no wonder. Bible CDP Israel, when they are this kind of problem, they are captivity. Oh, yeah. yeah. The Psalm said, when the captivity captivity of the Israelite was returned, it was like a dream. Okay. No matter what you have lost, no matter what your husband have lost, no matter what your wife have lost, no matter what your children have lost, no matter. What situation your family has as one body has lost? Yeah. Is anything hard for Almighty God to do? My dear brother, do not lose hope. My do not lose hope. My dad, do not lose hope. My mom, do not lose hope. Children, do not lose hope. Continue to look like, 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 like on to Jesus Christ. The finisher of our faith. Yes, Lord. My dear brother, renew your faith this evening. Call upon the name of the Lord. Father, renew my faith. Yes, renew my faith. Renew my strength, my faith, O Lord. Renew my strength, O Lord. Renew my strength. My sister is just more stroke. It's just more stroke. You are going to. Jesus. No, but, oh, but Jesus Christ, God will take you there. Oh, my God, God will take you there. Your the Lord will continue to be your strength. Do not let the devil win the battle. Jesus. You are conqueror already. The Bible let me know. Then when the situation comes, there's no need for you to more more. No, but you, there's no need for you to, 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 to put aside. Okay. Yes. Many may not understand what you are passing through. Your pastor may not understand. Your yeah. husband may not understand. Your wife may not understand. Those who go online may not understand. Those who go online may not understand. Your prayer colleague, your prayer mate may not even understand. But what I want you to know, Almighty God, why do you want to surrender? Why do you want to be back to faith? Why do you want to close your eyes? Why do you want to see where is that God, the God of Elijah? He's there. He's there. And your sister is going to fulfill this promise. One thing I want you to know. Many times you are failing him. Okay. He has never failed anybody. If he has not failed anybody, he will not fail you. Take courage. Take courage. He is shaking your destiny. For betterment of your family. Betterment of your life. For betterment of your end. Why? So that when you get to the heaven, when they get to the heaven, all of you will be there. You will see me. I will see you. 
Yes. You see your dad? I mean, your sister. You see your wife? <laughs> your children. <laughs> the people you play with. The situation we don't press away with you. And now we send that situation on to God now. The Father, this is the situation. Solve the problem for me, O oh Lord. I know that you can do it. I know that you are a God. I know that it's too late for you. I know that there's nothing impossible for you. I present myself before you. Father, by the next Thursday, I want to have testimony. I want to have testimony. Can you imagine when the hand or something was tied? Not doubting. I don't even think people are listening me. They hear what he said. But he, he told Almighty God, Renew my strength. His strength was renewed. The enemy was killed. Call upon the name of the Lord. And by the name of Jesus, I come unto you on the late hour of the day, calling upon you, depending upon you. Mindful that you are hearing me. Mindful that people are here, that we are praying together. Now, even if my faith is not enough, to see me through. The faith of these people is added to my faith. And I know you are going to ask me. You are going to answer my prayer. Surrender yourself to God in a fresh. The Bible let me know. What shall be the prophet of a man if he gain all this world and lose the kingdom of God? Leave yourself unto the Lord. Leave your husband to the Lord. Leave your wife unto the Lord. Lift your children unto the Lord. Tell God they are living sacrifice unto you. Let them to the Lord. Be a wonderful thing in their life. By the power of the blood of Jesus Christ, Father, do not let me lose heaven. Do not let me lose focus. Do not let me lose. Do not let my husband lose focus. Do not let my wife lose focus. Do not let my children lose focus. All those people who are, are in this journey with you, Father, do not, do not let us be focused in the name of Jesus Christ. Let your name be glorified. Let your name be peace in our life. Let my life turn to testimony to the people, oh Lord. The patience, the perseverance, the faith, the endurance which I need, oh my Father, to testify unto your name. I call upon the name of the Lord today. Lord, yes, it is this way. I am going to be the air and not the air. Many times we are pillar to the men the air. Call upon the name of the Lord. Wherever I be the air, Father, do not let me fall. Wherever I am a pillar, Father, do not let me disappoint you. Because a person head somewhere is another so is in another place is a pillar. Call upon the name of the Lord. My name do not let it be missed in the list of the book of life and kingdom of God. So shall it be. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Hey, Pastor Ali can pray for us now. I don't know if it's Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our Father, you are the man of war. God is a warrior. Yes. We are not because God is a warrior, he's a man of war. We that we are following him, we are not a civilian, we are soldiers. Yes. As a soldier, a knock is a no. There is rising up against anybody in this platform. Yes. Spiritual. Ministerially, physically, spiritually, I command us bad people to be overthrown in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I decree as a minister of the New Testament, 
by the power and the efficacy of the blood of the Lamb. Any man or woman that are carrying out dangerous sacrifice against any of your children on this platform, as we read in the book of Second Kings, chapter 3, when the book of Moab make a dangerous sacrifice against the nation go out against Israel. Any Moabite, any man or woman, any of that that is carrying out some dangerous sacrifice against any family, against any father, against any sister, on this prayer order, I command them to be thrown down in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says the rod of the wicked will not stress upon the soul, the Lord of the church. The Bible says the wickedness of the wicked will come upon his head. I speak of the ancient people of the Lord, and I command that the wickedness of the wicked will come Tonight I pronounce healing of the Lord. Tonight I pronounce deliverance of your life. Tonight I mean of your life. In the new month of May 2024, I and I declare whatever you have. You shall recover them in Jesus' name. Amen. My brother and my sister, this month it will be to be a month of recovery. My word. I began to take attention. Hey, hear me, hear me again. Over there. Somebody hearing me tonight, I say, are going to recover them. Amen. And as, as you recover everything, you have lost everything, everything you see the way, everything the ends you have everything away from your life, from your ministry, from your family. I command restoration back, they will restore them back upon your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. My sister, you are blessed. Amen. My brother, there is Worry about you are blessed. Amen. May the Lord Almighty preserve your life, keep you, and make you stronger than your enemies. Thank you, Father. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. By the grace of the Lord, we shall meet on the hour of victory on Saturday. Uh, continue to put you as into in, in your prayer as is uh, is now doing GCK in Philippines. From Philippines is moving to uh, United Arab uh, Arab States. So let us continue to put him in prayer. And they call his entourage and all the churches. The Almighty God will continue to strengthen them in Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus, every one of us, uh, we will fulfill destiny in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. Let's share the grace together. May the grace of our Lord the Lord and the flesh of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Shortly, goodness and peace of our life. Amen. People and then uh, let us continue to advertise. I think some of us were improving our publication. I mean publicity since last time. God continue to help us in Jesus' name. Thank you. God bless you. Good night, ma. Good night. Thank, Thank you, sir. God bless. God bless. All right. Yes. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.